shortly. Well, let me just make sure. <laughs> oh yeah. So uh, I'll show you this animal, and then I'll talk about. Ooh. And then I'll show you the difference, and explain to you the difference between black rats that we see in our houses and um, wood rats. So this is my toolbox for uh, checking traps in the morning. Looks like my bitch for a sec. Breakfast is in there and everything. Yeah, my oatmeal. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do is turn it over. I'm going to stick this glove right here. So this is just a little laundry bag. Yeah. Just zip it up over. And then I'm going to push this. And this is the Key Largo wood rat. Oh, he's so big. He's so cute. This is the most endangered species mammal in the Keys. Aww. So you can see her in the sun. She has a very good, he or she has a very I got a little odor. movie here. Can I see Not like first? a black rat odor at all. Aww. So you can see. Oh, the hawk. Yeah. Oh, oh, the the hawk is scaring. So the wood rat's nocturnal, so they don't real typically have to worry about hawks. Because their only native predators are, are snakes and maybe screech owls when they're uh, juveniles. This is a full-grown female. And actually, if you look, you can see I, there's a little tag with a number oh, on her ear. So I've already caught this individual. You think she'd learn. So she's used to this. <laughs> she wants that oatmeal. And right. yeah. It's not that bad. She knows it's coming back. It's a little extreme. So get that put has in an individual and... number so you can tell them apart. Showing around and all from and the free. And so people. from that information. Ow. <laughs> I was going to ask you if they bite if just I, a couple of hours. So from that information, we can tell how far they're moving and estimate how many individuals there are. We also take a little bit of genetic material. So the other thing to look at is, look at the tail. It's about the same length as the body and it's covered in hair. Mm -hmm. So when we think of rats, we yeah. think of a long, naked, yeah. ugly tail. Yeah. And this is a, a fully haired, kind of short, relatively short tail. You see the wood rat has a much uh, um, blunter face than a rat. And uh, so the interesting thing is when we think of things like black rats, they're in, a, they're in a totally different family than wood rats. Black rats belong to the Muridae. The wood rat belongs to the family Chrysetidae. So, Calling this a wood, uh, rat is actually a misnomer um, when you think about rats that we think of as pests uh, in people's houses because this is, it would, it's similar to say if you called a wolf a tiger. That's how uh, different they are. They're in different families <laughs> within the same order. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, if you all want to maybe stand there. I'm going to release her and she'll probably run right back into her nest. Are you going to check her number no first? Ah, no. uh, it's four. <laughs> if she climbs on you, don't do anything. Just stand there. Don't move. She won't bite you. Okay. Okay. So beautiful. There she goes. Okay. 